In tonight's medical file, it's all about fun in the sun here in South Florida. And protection against the sun's damaging rays is critical. And now there's a new option, a sunblock powder. CBS 4's health specialist, Dr. Sean Kniff, is here with more for us. Sean. Think about it, Rob. You can go to the powder room and protect yourself. Each year, more than one million Americans will develop some form of skin cancer, and the best weapon against it is to protect yourself. So take a look at the latest weapon, a new sun protective powder that promises to make those greasy creams and lotions a thing of the past. Hot bodies on hot days with terrific tans. It's the way many of us look down here. But according to dermatologist Dr. Judith Kroll, all that fun in the sun comes with a heavy price. Unfortunately, skin cancer is probably the most often diagnosed cancer of all body cancers. To protect against basal cell, squamous cell, and malignant melanoma, many of us lather on sunscreen. But now there's a whole new makeup line with an SPF of 30 for your protection. Now, macho men like me aren't going to be wearing makeup anytime soon, but some of us will be heading to the powder room with this new clear powder. You can't see it, and it'll be our little secret. Made by Color Science, the new powder isn't actually a powder at all. It looks like a powder, but it's actually a crushed mineral. The company says the powder provides complete coverage like this. If we were to cover the skin with billiard balls, there would still be exposed skin. But then they add different sized particles, in this case similar to golf balls, to fill in the holes. Then marbles, and so on and so on. Plus, there's more. They are uh, mixed with uh, zinc, a uh, 6% and um, titanium dioxide. Dr. Kroll says the powder protection is real and real easy to put on. She says even men should start powdering and protecting themselves. All they have to do is try it. Um, it's that first step that counts. Now this powder is also waterproof, but Dr. Kroll recommends frequent reapplication if you're in and out of the water or if you're out in the sun for more than an hour. Dr. Sean Kniff, CBS 4 News. We can't be too careful. Thank you, mm -hmm. Sean.